Hey everyone, it's Adam Schwartz with EXP Realty here in Reading, uh, doing a market update for the month of March, uh, like we like to do every month at the beginning of the month, just take a recap of the previous month, what happened with closed sales, new listings, and just kind of give you an overview of the market. Uh, we did see uh, home sales continue to be slow as expected with the higher interest rates. We were down about 40% in closed transactions for the month of February compared to last year's February. When you take into account the higher interest rates, that's not um, something that's a surprise to us in the industry. Um, today's rate is right around 7%, you know, in some cases higher than 7%, which is really making affordability challenging for the buyers in our market. Um, as far as inventory as a whole, we are still less than 600 homes on the market here in Shasta County, which when you think about, you know, Reading alone has 90,000 people uh, that live here. Um, that's not a lot of homes to choose from, but the biggest problem is based on our median income in Shasta County and what people can afford versus the payment when factoring in today's high interest rate is just pushing a lot of our buyers out of the market in total. Um, new listings, we were down about 40% in new listings coming to the market last month as well. So we've consistently seen our inventory grow little by little over the last uh, six months. However, with the extremely high rates, we're seeing less sellers want to come to the market because they're, you know, 90% of the homeowners that have a mortgage have an interest rate, you know, in the three to 4% range. And if they sell and capitalize on their equity, they're going to get into a home with a payment that, you know, has a 7% rate. And it's just really putting a lot of pressure on, you know, those types of sellers wanting to make a move in the market. So, I'm super grateful. We've been getting a lot of referrals still. We're really trying to educate our clients right now on the market, whether you're looking to sell a home or you're looking to buy a home. We really want to give you the best information as possible. So we're spending a lot of time uh, meeting with buyers at the office and in the listing consoles when we're going out to the houses, just explaining to them the current market, what we're seeing that's working today and not working, and then what to expect, you know, hope moving forward in the next few months, what, what could possibly happen with uh, the Federal Reserve meeting again and, and discussing, you know, I heard again today that they're looking at uh, raising their rate to combat inflation, which indirectly affects mortgage rates as well. So um, on a personal note, most of you that watch this know that I'm in real estate coaching and our new rule is we work from nine to two. The two is two warm leads. So we're looking to get two warm leads a day, friends, family, uh, anyone looking to buy or sell a home in the next three to six months. So I personally like going home to my family by about five o'clock, six, seven, if you know it's a busy day. And that's not possible until I start getting a couple leads in. So if you or anyone you know are looking at buying or selling a home or just have questions about the market, I would love to connect with you, talk to you, give you the best information I can moving forward. Uh, and then I can go home and spend some time with my family. So I hope everyone has a great day, has a great weekend, and I'll talk to you soon.